Hey Upstaters, welcome to your Power Pilates class. My name's Jess, I'll be taking you through class. All you need is your mat. If you've got weights, you can grab them at any time, but they are not essential. And let's get started. We're in a child's pose position on our mat. Bring your knees as wide as comfortable for you. Big toes are touching. Stretch your fingertips forward. Sink your hips down onto your heels. Bring your forehead to the mat and just breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. Staying here for a few more breaths. As always during class team, take breaks whenever you need to. I'll offer modifications on all of the postures, so take those if you wish, but there'll definitely be some challenges for when you are feeling strong. Most of all, we're just gonna have lots of fun. Take one more big breath, inhale, stretch those arms forward. Exhale, sink your hips down. On your next breath, slowly make your way to tabletop position. Bring your wrists directly under your shoulders, knees directly under your hips. We warm up with our cat and cow stretch. So taking an inhale, chest up, belly falls, cow stretch. Exhale, cat, chin to chest, round out your spine. Push the floor away. Inhale, cow pose. Drop the belly, lift the chest. Exhale, cat. Round out through your spine. One more each way, team. Inhale, looking up to the sky. Arch that lower back. Exhale, chin to chest. Rounding out through your spine. Pressing through your hands. Slowly return to a neutral position with your spine. Neck is long. Bird dog. Extend your right leg behind you, pointing your right toes, and reach your left arm forward. Find your balance here. We tap our hand and foot to the mat at the same time. Float them back up. Lower. And lift. Let's go for three more. And lift. Two more. Lift. Last one. Up, hold there. Reach your fingertips, reach your toes. Five, four, three, two, and one. Hand and knee down. Transition, high plank. Step the right foot back, followed by your left. Hold. Modification. Lower your knees down, otherwise knees are lifted. Inhale, right leg lifts. Exhale, squeeze your right knee to your right tricep. Inhale, float it back. We've got three more. Float it back. Two more. Float it back. Last one. Float it back. Hold your leg up off the floor for five, four, three, two, and one. Drop your foot down, high plank. Press it back, downward dog. Send your hips up and back. You might like to bend one knee at a time here. Pedaling out through those feet. Just enjoying a nice stretch down the back of the legs. Draw your abdominals in. Pausing nice and still. Inhale, float forward, high plank. Shoulders over wrist, neck is long. Come to the knees at any time that you need to. Left leg lifts up. Exhale, squeeze your left knee to your left tricep. Inhale, float it back. Exhale, tuck it in for three. Inhale, float it back. We've got two more, squeeze. Float it back, stay strong team. Last one, tuck, float it all the way back. Hold your foot off the floor. Five, four, three, two, and one. Left foot down, lower your knees down. Four point kneeling, knees under hips, wrists stay under shoulders. Bird dog, left leg extends behind you. Stretch it back up in line with your hip. Right arm reaches forward, hold. Keep your neck long. 
find your balance. Tap your hand and foot to the mat at the same time. Lift it back up. We lower and lift. We've got three more. And lift. You've got this up, Staters. Two more. Our warm up nearly done. Last one. Up. Hold there. Reach. Squeezing through that left glute. Five, four. Abs on tight. Three, two, and one. Hand and knee down. Child's pose. Bring those knees wide. Stretch it forward. Releasing through your shoulders. Amazing start to class, team. Come on up to seated. Roll out your wrists, roll out your shoulders. We are going into our core series. Five exercises. I'll demonstrate your first move. It's a single leg reach. So we're lying all the way down on our back. Legs are long. Left arm stays on the mat. Right arm comes over your head. We exhale. Press all the way up. Reach your pinky finger to your pinky toe. Twist. Slowly roll back down. Your modification, lift the shoulders off the mat, tap the shin, slowly come back down. Let's do it, team. We've got 50 seconds. Timer is on. Exhale, lift, reach. Use your left hand to help you come all the way up. Slowly roll back down. Exhale, lift, reach, squeeze. Simultaneously, we slowly lower the leg and lower the chest down, pulling those abdominals in. If you want that challenge, you can keep your left hand over your chest here. Lift all the way up, reach. Remember your modification here. You can just lift, tap your hand to your shin, slowly come back down. Exhale, lift. Challenge is to come all the way up. Keep the leg nice and straight. We only do every move once, guys. In this class, let's work hard. Exhale, reach and slowly lower. Let's get one more all the way up. Slowly come back down and time. Ankle taps, exercise two. Bend your knees, feet flat. Lift your head, neck and shoulders up. Let's go reach around and around. Your knees stay nice and still. Bring all the awareness to the abdominals. Take it out of the neck. If you need to, place your hands behind your head. Interlock your fingers and just alternate from side to side. Otherwise, we're reaching around. Arms are nice and long. Push, push, you've got it. Reach to your right now. Pulse it down, down, really squeeze. Shortening that distance between your ribs and your hips. Last two, one, other side, let's go. Pulse, 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 really squeeze. Working our obliques, three, two, one and time. Legs are long. Exercise three. Your single leg reach. Left arm over your head. Let's go. Reach all the way up. Pinky toe. Pinky finger to pinky toe. Slowly roll back down. Working through that right leg. Lift all the way up. Lift, reach. Slowly come back down. Modification. Just lift. Tap your hand to your shin. Slowly lower back down. Empower Pilates, it's all about the strength, that endurance to keep going for 50 seconds, but knowing you only have to do everything once. So keep it controlled and work to your edge. Abs are starting to burn now, guys. Slow on the way down. Let's get two more and reach. One more, let's go all the way up. Slowly lower down, amazing. Bring those legs to tabletop. You have a crunch and extension. Fingertips to temples, elbows wide. We crunch up, double leg extension. Back to tabletop, lower back down. Exhale, lift, extend, tabletop and lower. Modification, crunch up, single leg extension or you can just bring your feet flat to the ground. Crunch up, lower back down. How's those abs up, staters? Exhale, lift, double leg extension, tabletop and lower. Feeling it straight through the middle of those abdominals. Stay in it, team. Lift, extend, bend and lower. Last one, lift up, extend, bend 
and time. Pilates hundreds to finish. Legs are at tabletop, arms over your head. Exhale, curl on up, pump those arms. Hinging from the shoulders, modification, feet flat. If you need to rest the head, rest the head, then come straight back up. That challenge, right leg is extended. I'll tell you when to switch it. You can take the further challenge by extending both legs straight away. Heels together, toes turned out. Pull the lower belly in. Create that heat, guys. Challenge yourself. Extend left leg now. If you had the right leg extended, switch it up. Push and breathe. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. This is your last exercise. Extend both legs long. You've got under 10 seconds now. Chin away from your chest. Chest up further. Legs down lower. Three, two, and time. Well done, team. Slowly roll onto your right side. We're straight into side line glute work. Right side. Bring your legs to tabletop position. Knees are in line with your hips. Keep it nice and long. We have a leg lift. Extend your top leg out in front of your body. Turn your toes down to the mat. We lower and lift. So that leg is lowering, lifting up just in line with your hip. Lower and lift. Our challenge is to keep our leg straight out in front of our body. Down and up. If you need to, you can always move your leg back on the diagonal to modify here. Lower and squeeze. This section all about your glutes, guys. Squeeze and lower. Exhale, push and lower. On your next one, hold it up. Little pulses, let's go up, up, up. You can have your hand underneath your ear if you like. Really actively squeeze that left glute. Get right in there. Make the most of each exercise, guys. We only do it once on this side and once on the other. Push, five, four, three, two, one, and hold. From here, we bend our leg back to tabletop, extend it back out. Bend and extend. Just as simple as that. Simple and effective, guys. You know we're gonna start to feel it in that left glute. Bend and push. Keep your toes flexed back towards your shins, drawing your abdominals in, and your right waist is slightly off the mat. Start to think about anything else other than your glutes, guys, as it starts to burn. It's exactly why we sign up for this class. That burning sensation, building that strength here, all the way out and bend. Second exercise out of five. You've got three, two, and one. Extend out, hold. We sweep our leg back. Squeeze your glute, bring it behind you and sweep your leg forward. Imagine your leg is like a pendulum, nice and strong. It stays in line with your body. Squeeze your left glute. Keep that leg up in line with your hip, guys. The further you bring it back and squeeze the glute, the more strength you are building. You can have your left hand on the mat if you need support. Yes, guys. <sighs> Breathing, exhale as we press it back. Inhale as we float it forward. Exhale, press back. Inhale forward on your next one back. Hold it back, hold it back. Little pulses backwards. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Get that contraction, find that sweet spot. You've got it. Three, two, one, and time. Keep your leg in line with your body. We've got circles, team. Leg up, let's go little circles. Forward circles. You can come up onto that elbow or all the way up, lifting the side body off the floor to get that challenge zone. Otherwise, just stay lying down. One exercise left after this. Keep those toes flexed. Yes, feel that burn. Just breathe through it. On your next one, reverse it. Let's go. Kick it back. Kick it back. Small circles, the size of a tennis ball here. Feels like we can't lift up our leg anymore, but we can finish it together. Strong up, staters. You know we only have one more move. Eight seconds to go. 
circling it right to the very end. Come on, let's get two more circles. One more and time. Float your leg back forward. The same as what we did at the start. Your leg lift, angle those toes down, lower and lift. Lower and lift. This is your finisher. That leg is forward of your body as far as you can get it. Toes are flexed, angle them down towards the mat. Just breathe, guys. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Just in line with your body. Pull those abdominals in. Contracting through your thigh. Come on, work hard, guys. It's the last one here. Squeeze, lift, and lower. We want that burn. That's exactly what we want to feel. It's okay if you're feeling it. On your next one, 10 seconds, let's go. Pulse it up, up, up. Mind over matter. <sighs> Right to the end. Three, two, one, and time. Straight into your forearm side plank, guys. We work through the upper body as well now. Elbow under the shoulder. Stack your hips and ankles. Let's lift on up and hold. Reach your left arm to the sky. Hold it there. Your modification here is to bring your top foot forward or drop your bottom knee down. That's absolutely fine. Our challenge for this round, Turn your palm to face your thigh. Draw your arm down towards your hip and all the way back up to the sky. Push up out of your right shoulder and lift. Down and lift. Contract those glutes, guys. Squeeze, push your hips forward. Staying here is the modification. Otherwise, staying in your full side forearm plank. First one out of five, guys. Squeeze. Last 10, hold it up, reach. Hips up higher, top hip forward. Push, feel those obliques. Squeezing the glutes, lift. Three, two, and time. High plank, hands under your shoulders. Step it back and hold. Modification, lower your knees down. Your challenge, you have a core climber. Bringing your left knee out and around to your left tricep. Place your foot back down, right knee, out and around, right tricep. Place your foot back down, just like we did in our warm up. Otherwise, come to the knees to modify. Squeeze and extend. Squeeze and extend. Find length through your neck. Squeeze those obliques even more. We worked them in our core series. We're working them now. Doubling up on the same muscle group, building that strength. Amazing team. Keep that energy exactly where it is. We've got three, two, and time. Come down, forearm plank. Elbows under your shoulders. Separate your hands, palms, and hold your forearm plank. Modification, lower the knees down. Your challenge, we have double knee dips. So both knees, tap the mat gently. Extend your legs long. Both knees, tap the mat gently. Extend your legs long. If your knees are already on the mat, just lift one knee off at a time. <sighs> Feel that contraction through your lower abdominals. Everything is tight. Pull it in. Wrapping those ribs around. Keep breathing. Abs are fired up, guys. That's exactly what we want. This is a smaller movement than what you think. Little tap. And extend, one more. Tap and extend, time. Spider-Man push-ups, guys. Hands under the shoulders, step it back. We've already warmed up for this. Bring the knee to the elbow at the same time. Lower down for your push-up. Press back up, step it back. Right knee to right elbow, lower down. Press back up, step it back. Modification, come to the knees. Tuck the tailbone, knee to the elbow. Inhale, lower. Exhale, press. Otherwise, you can just hold your plank and go for that knee to elbow, or you can do regular push-ups here. That's it, upstaters. Spider-Man push-ups, obliques, upper body strength. Our whole body is working here. Everything is contracted. Switch it on tight. Let's get one more. Knee in, down, push up, 
and time into your side, forearm plank, other side. We're already here, finishing off the plank series. Elbow under the shoulder, stack the hips, stack the ankles, lift on up, reach your right arm up, hold, modification. Top foot forward or bottom knee down. Lift and reach. Push those hips forward. Pull those abdominals in. Your challenge, turning your hand, drawing it down to your thigh and back up to the sky. If you're feeling it in your left shoulder, that's okay. We're meant to be. We're squeezing through that left shoulder, but we're lifting our hips, working our obliques. Push, guys. You are much stronger than what you think. Maybe you could come up into that full side plank just to finish off this series here. Give it a go. You never know until you try. You're capable of more than what you think, guys. Lift on up. Hold it there. 10 seconds. Reach. Everyone, arm up. Hips up. Top hip forward. Lock the core. Shaking is good, guys. Three, two, and time. Well done. Straight to side lying. Other side. Then we get a stretch, guys. Lie down on your left side. Bring your legs to tabletop to start with. Knees in line with hips. Lift your top leg up. Extend it out in front of your body and turn your toes down towards the mat. Into your leg lift. Up and down. Up and down. Making sure that leg is in front of your body as if you were swinging it towards your nose and then hold it at your maximum and just lift and lower. And lower. No surprises, upstaters. Five exercises here. And then we stretch out through our legs. On your next one. Lift it up, hold it up, squeeze. Little pulses, let's go up, up, up. Contract that right glute. Bring your awareness to where you want to work. Get into the zone here, guys. Squeeze up, up. You've got eight seconds to go. <sighs> Maximize the movement here. Push. Three, two, one, and hold into our bend and extend. Let's go. Bend and extend. Exercise number two out of five. Bend and extend. Keep that leg in tabletop as you bring it back and press your heel forward. That option to have your hand underneath your ear. That's cool too. How good do these ones feel, guys? They're deceiving. We get to the second exercise and all of a sudden we start to feel our glutes. That's exactly what we want. Push. If you need to, you can modify by just lifting and lowering that top leg. Otherwise, we're extending out and bending in. Abs are locked on as well here. Extend and bend. Hips are stacked. Push. Let's get two more, come on. Push and bend. One more. Extend and bend. Extend and hold. You've got it, guys. Let's go for our sweep. Sweep it back. Sweep it forward. Your leg is like a pendulum hinging from the hip. Maybe that leg is starting to shake. That's awesome news, guys. As you sweep it back, squeeze that right glute as much as possible. Swing it forward, squeeze. Sweep it back, push. Swing it forward, squeeze. You can have your right hand on the mat just to support you here. Otherwise, just focus on keeping your right hand on your hip to make sure those hips are stacked. You know what's coming, guys. On your next one, sweep it back. Let's go. Pulse it back, back. Really work hard here. Squeeze that right glute as much as possible. Three, two, one, and time. Staying where you are, bring your leg in line with your body. Little circles up, staters. Two exercises to go. We can be here. If you want that full challenge, come up onto your forearm, elbow under the shoulder, lifting that side body and circling. Keep the chest proud. <sighs> Keep angling those toes back towards the shins here. Control that movement. We're lifting that leg through sand, guys. Your modification, come back down, lie down. Let's reverse it. Come on, together, push. <sighs> Squeeze that right glute. We are building so much strength, guys. If it feels like you can't circle that leg, leg around, that's okay. Take a break and then get straight back up into it. Whatever you need, just work hard. Squeeze around. Let's get two more. One more and 
and time. Last one. Sweep your leg all the way forward, just as we did at the start of class. The finisher. Toes angle down to the mat. Lift and lower. Up in line with the body, guys. Find that sweet spot. Contract that right glute and go for it. Whatever you need to think about here to get you through this movement, you've done it once on one side. You can do it again, guys. I believe in you. Come on, squeeze. You want to get the most out of it. That's why you turned up. Lift. It's the last time you're doing this movement. Push yourself right to that edge where you feel like you can't lift your leg anymore. Get ready. Let's go. Pulse it up. 10 seconds. That's all you've got. Up, up, up. Squeeze. Push through that pain. That's it, team. You've got this. Three, two, and time. Amazing. Let's roll on to our back. We have a stretch out here. It's our figure four stretch. So bend up your knees. Cross your left ankle over your right knee. Hold and slide your hands behind your right thigh. Squeeze in. So it's a brief stretch here. Then we get straight into our upper body. And release. Let's go to the other side. Right ankle over the left. Slide your hands behind your left thigh and squeeze in that glute. Still a little tender. That's okay. Pull it in, team. And release. Everyone coming up to kneeling. We are going straight into our upper body series. I will demonstrate your first exercise. You have got a tricep kickback. So we hinge our torso slightly forward. Elbows up in line, nice and high. We exhale to squeeze it back, inhale to bend. Let's set it up, team. Timer is on. Draw those abdominals in here, lengthen through your body. Exhale, squeeze, inhale to bend. Exhale, squeeze, inhale to bend. If you need to modify up status, sit your hips down on your heels and push it back. This round, all about the upper body, then we get back into our glutes, guys. Elbows higher than you want them to go. Squeeze. You've got this, guys. Push on your next one. You know it. Kick it back. Let's go, little pulses. Up, up. Create that cramp in the back of your arms. Squeeze as much as possible. Mind over matter. Lift those arms up. Three, two, one and time. We're going back to triceps, but this time it's overhead. So bring your arms up, palms together, interlock the thumb, hinge the torso slightly forward. We bend and press. Hands down between the shoulder blades and press. Press those palms together. If you've got the weight, you can separate the hands, squeeze. If it gets too much, team, just go back to your regular tricep kickback. You can also sit the hips down at any time. Down and up, doubling up on the same muscle group here. Building that strength. Remember, it's about the endurance. So much power building in this class. Bend and extend. Fire it up, guys, on your next one. Bend, little pulses, up, down. Up, down, press your palms together. Let's go, five, four, three, two, one, and time. High kneeling position, you've got arm circles. Raise those arms up, we're getting into the shoulders. Little circles forward, squeeze your glutes. Tummy is on nice and tight. Just two more exercises after this one. If you don't have the weights, make sure your arms are active. If I was to come over there and slam down on your arm, it would not move. So keep it contracted, nice and controlled. And let's reverse it, guys. <sighs> Breathe here. Squeezing your glutes. Tummy is locked on. As much as we want the shoulders to shrug up, relax them down, let it burn. That's exactly what you want. Squeeze. Abs are fired as well. We've got eight seconds to go. Nobody drops their arms down. Everyone keeps them up. Push for three, two, one. And time, take a break if you need, then bring those arms to cactus, shoulder press in two and one. Let's go up and down, up and down. Elbows pause in line with your shoulders every time. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower. Up, staters, I can feel that energy from here. You are so strong. 
incredible shoulder presses. Big exhale as you press up. You know there's one, one exercise to go and this series is done. We never have to come back to it. Making the most out of every move while we're in it. On that next one, cactus, little pulses, let's go up, up, squeeze. Even if you don't have those weights, you are squeezing those shoulders up, down, up, down. For three, two, and one. Take a break if you need. And then meeting up for your high bicep curl in two and one. Let's go, palms face you. 90 degree angle with those arms. Extend out and bring it in 90 degrees. Extend out, bring it in 90 degrees. Out. This is the gun show, guys. Come on. Get those guns out. Squeeze. Big exhale. If you need to, drop the elbows down. Just go into your regular bicep curl. Still squeezing. Otherwise, arms are up. Simultaneously working biceps and shoulders. Abs are locked, guys. Arms will feel so good after this one. You know what's coming. On your next one, let's go. Hold, pulse it up, up, up. Challenging yourself. Dig deeper now. Let's go lift even further for three, two, one, and time. Straight into your four-point kneeling series, guys. We have a basic leg lift. Hands are under the shoulders, knees are under your hips. Right leg is long, flex your foot, flex your toes. Lift and lower. Contract your right glute, lift and lower. Every exercise is as hard as you make it, guys. So it's easy to just hang out here. But if you contract that thigh and squeeze your glute, that burn will kick in so soon. If you need to, come down onto the elbows. You can do the same exercise. Pulling the lower abdominals in. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. On your next one, kick it up. Let's go. Pulse it up, up, up. Squeeze that right glute for five, four, three, two, one and time. You have a fire hydrant with your right leg. So coming back, hands under shoulders, lift your right knee out to the side, squeeze your right glute, coming back in. I'll show you the view from a different angle. Right knee out to the side, just like a tabletop leg and bring it back down. Exhale, squeeze, inhale, lower. Flexing those toes back towards the shins here. Keep that 90 degree angle in the knee. Just lift your leg as high as you can go for your flexibility. It's not necessarily about how high you lift it. It's about the squeeze as you lift it. You've got this guys. On your next one, hold it up. 10 seconds, little pulses. Up, up, up. Push through now, come on. Get that leg up a little higher. Three, two, one and time. Straight to your leg lift on the other side. Left leg extends, toes back towards the shins. We lift and squeeze and lower. Lengthen through your neck and lower. Up staters, find that comfort in knowing that we have two exercises left of your four point kneeling series and you are done with this series, standing up for the rest of class. We are already here. You've come this far. Why would we give up now? Squeeze. Coming down to the elbows if you need to. Lift and push. Push. Remember, contract that glute. On your next one, lift up, pulse it up. It's only 10 seconds, guys. Make sure it's coming from the glutes and not your lower back. Lift, lift for three, two, one. And time, fire hydrant left side. Onto the hands if you can. Flexing through those toes. We lift that left leg up and lower it down. Keeping that 90 degree angle in your knee. You might be feeling this in your right glute. Your stabilizing glute. Push, lift and lower. You guys are on fire. I can feel those glutes burning from here. Squeeze, lift and lower. Lengthen through your neck here. Remember, it's not just about how high you can lift your leg. It's about how much you can squeeze it up and down. Let's go on your next one. You know it. Leg up, little pulses. Up, up, up. Keep the weight even between your hands and your right knee. Pulse, come on, higher. 
four, three, two, one, and time. Your final posture, your hover. Hands stay under the shoulders, knees under the hips, tuck your toes, hover your knees one inch off the mat. Hold. If we want our challenge here, separate through your feet. You have a hand to ankle tap. It's challenging, it requires your core strength. Hand taps the ankle, place it back down. Opposite hand, opposite ankle. Test out your strength, guys. Give it a go. You separate through the feet, engaging through those abdominals. Otherwise, you can just hold still. Yes, team. Find your balance here. If you get the wobbles, that's okay. On your next one, hold your hover. You've got 10 seconds. Lengthen your back. Squeeze those abdominals. Eye gaze down to your mat. Everything is pulled in for five, four, three, two, and time. Come on up, team. Your final set here. Five exercises and you are done. We start with our curtsy lunge squat. So we'll be sitting down in a squat position. Here's your demonstration. Hinge the torso slightly forward. We do one squat. Right leg steps behind, curtsy lunge. One squat, right leg steps behind, curtsy lunge. Let's do it together, guys. I'll show you that view from the front. Three, two, and 150 seconds. Squat, right leg curtsy. Keep the torso hinged forward. Squat, right leg curtsy. If you want to add arms here, you can add your fly. As you come out for your curtsy, add the fly. Any knee injuries, you can just squat and step it back for a regular lunge or just squat down and up. That's absolutely fine. Otherwise, we're going one squat, right leg curtsy. One squat, right leg curtsy. Coming to that back end of class, guys. Let's get into that next gear. A few minutes of your time and you are done. 10 seconds, let's go. Kick it back, pulse it down. Down, feel that left glute working. Get your back knee down. Smile, guys. Three, two, one, and time. Into your chair hold here. Feet together, sit the hips down. Heels are slightly apart. Hold, lengthen those arms once you're ready. Biceps are next to your ears, nice and long. We're just holding. Once you've got your form, let's come up onto those tippy toes. Inner thighs are squeezing together. Sit down lower in your chair, little pulses squeeze. Squeeze just when we thought we had no more legs. We are burning them out right here, right now. If the arms is too much, bring your hands back to heart centre. Otherwise, keep them extended long. Pulse it down, squeeze those legs together, guys. On your next one, hold it there, hold it there. It's only 10 seconds, guys. Lift those heels higher, sit down lower. Draw those lower bellies in, yes. You've got four, three, two, and time. Amazing squat, curtsy lunge, left leg steps behind. Feet hip with distance, let's go straight away, squat. Left leg curtsy, take it slow to start with. You can add those arms if you like. Think about how good you're gonna feel after this class, knowing that you gave it your all, guys. Hinge that torso slightly forward. Make sure your right knee is tracking over your toe, not letting it wave out to the side too much. <sighs> Option to take that break at any time, otherwise you stay with it. Just know that everything you're feeling, everyone else is feeling it too. Squeeze on your next one. Let's do this guys, pulse it down. Down your final curtsy pulses for today. Lower and lower, get your back knee hovering off the mat. Stay down low, three, two, one, and time. Into your sumo squat, W press. Nice wide stance, toes turned out. Elbows in, make a W. We squat down, knees track out over the toes. As we lift up, press out for your W press. Keep your back straight down and push. Back is nice and straight. Tailbone is tucked under at the back. Elbows draw in. Push it out. Big squeeze of your glutes at the top. Firing up inner thighs here as well, guys. Your legs will love you after class. Biceps are working hard too in our W press. Up status, one exercise left after this. <sighs> Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. On your next one, hold. Hold, little pulses of the arms, let's go. It's only eight seconds now. In and out, in and out. Contract those biceps. 
feel that heat. Let's go, get lower. Three, two, one, and time. Come up and come straight back down. Whoop, for your last exercise, team. Find your balance here. You've got a high bicep curl, just like we did earlier. Hold those arms out, up to 90, and extend. Now get low, everyone. Bend and extend. You can come up if you need, take that break, and then get straight back down. Let those legs burn, guys. Sit even more, lower than you can. Draw those abdominals in, tuck that tailbone under. 90 degree angle, and extend out. 90 degree angle, and extend out. Squeeze those biceps. You've got this team. Hold those arms 90 degrees. Get low, let's pulse it down. Down, right till the very end. We finish strong, all together. Four, three, two, one, and time. Let it down, team. We made it to our cool down. Everyone, onto your mat. We have a child's pose, starting class, ending class just as we started. Knees are wide. Stretch those arms forward, breathe. Sink it back. Let the heart rate come down. On your next breath, slowly make your way up. We'll just stretch out through our hip flexors here. So bring your right foot forward. Back knee, your left knee under your hip. Tuck your tailbone under. You have that option to bend a little further forward. And if you want a deeper stretch in that hip flexor, bring your left arm up and reach over to the side. Feeling the oblique stretching out here as well. Slowly release. Let's hinge it back for our hamstring stretch. Flexing through the toes, sinking the hips back, drawing the abdominals in. If you've got that flexibility, you can bring your forehead down. Whatever feels good for you. And slowly release. Let's switch sides here. Bring your left foot forward, right knee under your hip. Tuck your tailbone under. If you need more, you can lunge forward just slightly and reach that right arm up to get a little deeper. Maybe bending over to the side. How good does it feel at the end? You guys were incredible, so strong. Slowly come back. Let's sink our hips back for our hamstring stretch, left leg, toes are flexed. Hinge it back now. Whatever feels good. If you wanna bring the forehead down, go for it. If you wanna sit the hips all the way down, no problem. And slowly release. Coming to seated. Legs are long. Let's take our roll down together. Arms are long, chin to chest. Use those abdominals for the last time. Roll it down. Once you arrive on your mat, Savasana, just melt into the floor. You deserve this rest for your body, for your mind. Take a big, big breath in. Exhale out. One more together, let's go. Inhale, fill up. Exhale out. Upstaters, you are all done. You were incredibly strong. Give yourselves a massive round of applause. Super strong bodies. Thank you so much for joining in Power Pilates today. My name is Jess from Upstate. Hopefully I'll see you guys soon.